Welcome back. It's Christy with Anchor Life 5, or welcome to my channel if you are brand new. I appreciate you stopping by. So, what do you guys do on your lunch break? You know what I do on my lunch break today? I went to two Dollar Trees. Yeah, I know. Kind of sad. But I went to two Dollar Trees on my lunch break today. So, let me show you what I got. First of all, we're going to start with all the Christmas stuff I got. Okay. They had these adorable little boxes here and they were all like little Christmas villages and I didn't realize until just now that I have two of these the sweet shop but they are heavy duty and they come they were three different sizes um, let's see okay so these are the three different sizes that they came in had the sweet shop and then I got whoo sorry I knocked that the toy shop look how cute that is I mean even if you don't use these like to wrap things in I mean how cute would that be just sitting in your house and like the roofs are look like snowy and then I got the train station so stinking cute and another one of the sweet shops didn't realize I had two of those and then I found these adorable little plastic pails. Um, they had probably about four or five different um, decorations. These um, are like Santa's little buckle, and it's got like the little thingy there to, you know, like they stay fresh or whatever. So I got two of the Santa buckles, and then I got two of the um, snowflakes. And it comes with the little handles. Oh, how cute would this be? Like to fill with cookies or candy or craft supplies or just about anything um, and gift for Christmas. So I was, I really, really like those. I found a couple more boxes. Um, we have these right here. And they, like I said, there was many different um, designs. And then on the inside, it says to and from an amount. They're like little gift. Um, card holders so even if you don't use them for gift card holders you know I mean take that out and it's just a really cute little box as well and then um, one more box um, here let's open this one up because it says there's two oh sorry that was a lot of arm um, <laughs> this one says there's two two boxes so they're just probably like little nesting boxes, but um, they had a lot of different different ones of these also. Um, oh, so there we go. Merry Christmas. And then I like that was it says do not open. So I mean, come on, a dollar for two of those, really really good deal. And then um, a few more Christmas items. I did pick up the pack of mini bows and what I've actually done with some of these and I think I sent them all out to people but I made um, really really cute paper clips with them um, I just took a paper clip and I double sided the bow super simple and they were really really cute um, so I'm gonna use those for crafting not for wrapping I got those and then um, I got the green doilies in the two different sizes. This is the 10 count and this is the 16 count. I'm going to use those for wrapping actually. And then they had really, really cute wall art that you would totally not think was from Dollar Tree. This one says, Have Yourself a Merry Little Christmas. And it's like in a canvas. And I mean, this is something like you would find at um, Hobby Lobby. Or Kirkland's or anything like you would not think that was from Dollar Tree so I was excited about that and then really really like this one this one is like a wood decoration oh my god I'm sorry about that glare it says Merry Christmas December 25th North Pole and the snowflakes um, I mean it's it's you know it's cheaply made but like that side of it if I have that hanging up in my house Nobody would ever know that was from the Dollar Tree. So, super excited about that one. And then I got 
this whole collection right here of the vanilla cream. Um, had not seen these in any of my Dollar Trees. So I picked up, I don't think it's the entire collection, but this was as much as I could find. So I did get the hand wash and the vanilla cream. And I got the vanilla cream pure vegetable soap. This is seven ounces. Um, this is 13.5 ounces. And then I did get the vanilla cream facial wipes. Um, there's 30 of them in here and they're, um, yeah, I don't know. Use daily in addition to add normal skin regimen to give skin added protection against premature aging. I need that. And the sun and pollution. Yeah, I, I don't know. We will totally see how that works. I'm not quite sure. And then I got the body cream. And this is 3.5 ounces. Let's see if it's open. Oh, no, I want to smell it so bad. So I did get that. And then I got two of the bath fizzers. Relax and soak and let stress melt away. These are the three ounce in the vanilla cream. And then I did get the body oil. Um, this is one fluid ounce. Um, and this is for face, skin, and hair. Body oil provides your skin the nutrients it needs to support healthy, youthful appearance and retain moisture balance uh, benefits from head to toe. It provides ultimate moisture for skin, face, and hair. So after shower or bath when skin is still damp, smooth on a few drops to help seal in moisture. Let body dry naturally or simply pat dry with a towel. Massage two to three drops of healing therapy oil into clean, moist skin on the neck, face, or body, morning or night, suitable for all types of skin. Hmm. Interesting. So we will see how that works. Um, I did get a few crafting items. Um, well, this one is for my desk, actually. It is um, by Essentials. It is the organizer. Um, and I actually got this to go on top of my desk um, so I can keep like my pencil and my pen and my punch. Um, things that I need like readily accessible. Maybe like any like little embellishments that I'm working on for a certain project. Um, so I got that. And then I got... Um, but I'm trying to grab it over here. I did get the, the shipping labels. I know everybody's probably seen those. I mean, you always need shipping labels. And I did get the Mod Podge. This is two fluid ounces of Mod Podge. And I've actually never used Mod Podge before. And so I'm really excited to give that a try. Um, okay. I use these. I actually saw this on coupons to provide on her channel. Um, and she uses these chopping mats as cutting boards. And I was like, oh my God, what a great idea. I mean, you think about it, you're like, you know, chopping with a knife on these. And so they've got to work like for exacto knives and other stuff like that. And so I always keep one of these on top of my surface because it is, um, you know, a black desk and it scratches very easily. And so I keep these on top of my desk for my, I put my glue gun on it when I'm working, anything that I'm working on, I um, put on top of this and they're great and it's two for a buck. All right, guys, I was so excited to see this. I have never seen this before and I haven't seen anybody haul these. Um, these are by Jot and these are the foam mounting squares. Now I know, and these were actually in the crafting stuff. Um, and I have seen like the rolls of the, the mounting squares, um, like in the hardware stuff, but I have never seen these. Um, and it doesn't say how many you get, but I mean, you get quite a good amount of them. And then, oh my God, they had the foam mounting dots. And this one does say double sided 48 dots. So I got two of these. I mean, these are absolutely amazing. Um, and like I said, I'd never seen these before and I was super, super stoked to find those. And the last, um, two, two or three more things. Um, I did get these zebra, um, mechanical pencils just because I'm always looking for a freaking pencil for something and I can never find one because my kids always steal them. So I did pick up those. 
um, super glue. I always need super glue up here um, to make my pen loops for my traveler's notebooks. I found that the elastic I think sticks better with super glue than with hot glue. And then I did pick up four of these spiral notebooks and it has like the little pocket right here. And what I'm actually going to do with these is, um, and I like it because they're just, just plain. There's a couple of sheets of plain paper and then there's the line paper. But what I'm going to do with these, I've seen on another channel, is you unspiral these and then you add a new cover to it. Genius, I know. So I figured for a buck, I'm going to try these out. And that is it, guys. Um, thanks for watching. And until next time, bye.